Shooting 60 millimeter film is like, I don't know, something expensive, really expensive. But if you're gonna do it, then there's something I wanted to let you in on. And that is the importance of knowing if your camera takes single perf film or double perf film. Perf is just how those of us in the know say perforation, which is just a fancy way of saying hole on the film. Brand new 16 millimeter film is single perforated film, which means that it has sprocket holes down only one side of the film itself. This film can be used in tons of cameras, things like Bolexes, Aries, Canon Scopix, Atons, all those big ones. There's also double per 16 millimeter. 16 millimeter double perforated film has holes down both sides of the film and is used in double perf cameras. Most double perf cameras are older than single perf cameras. Lots of older cameras like Bell and Howell cameras and early Bolexes take double perforated film. The type of film that the camera takes is based on the sprocket rollers inside of the camera. So my Bolex here takes single perforated film or it can take double perforated film because there's only spikes on one side of this roller. The camera is meant for use with single perf film, but there's also nothing stopping me from using double perf film in this as well. If you have an older camera, then just check the rollers inside of the camera before buying your film. If your rollers have spikes on both sides, then you need to go get yourself double perf film if you want to use that camera. Using single perf film in a double perf camera can damage the film because there aren't sprocket holes for that second set of spikes. Now your choices are limited for double per 16 millimeter these days, but Film Photography Project has you covered and they offer a variety of different 16 millimeter film stocks with double perforations. Also, Pro 8 millimeter will be releasing some soon as well, so you should have no problem feeding those old, old 16 millimeter cameras. So single perf or double perf film in single perf cameras, double perf film only in double perf cameras. I don't think I can make it any clearer saying perf over and over again has just started to sound really weird to me. If you're still confused, just watch the video again and again and again and again. I'm Noah, this is Analog Essentials where I teach all you guys a little snippet of analog something. Check out the description for links to the Analog Resurgence Patreon if you want to support this stuff and links for getting some Super 8 and 16 and whatever, all that motion picture stuff for yourselves as well. So like, comment, and subscribe or whatever it is that you want to do and uh, I'll see you guys soon.